Hello, it's great to be here. My name is Javier Canton, and we are in the Plain Contest Madrid office today. We have been working on something really special, and I hope you all will enjoy. In my time in the company, we have the opportunity to collaborate with many companies in the industrial sector. And all of them have a big challenge ahead of them to incorporate more 3D technology to create the next level of digital twins. That will allow them to have better control of the process, capture the real-time status, and make simulation with all the data to reduce costs, improve, and evolve faster than before. We believe that with emerging technology, many companies can benefit from having custom 3D technology with the latest advance in computer graphics. And one of the most important things, it is easy to integrate in legacy and new application. Many of our customers are using inside WPF or Windows Phone desktop application, as well as the web-based applications. Today, we are glad to announce the first Evergreen 2023 major version, which is the next chapter in this technology, to update it to the new challenge for this year. We have made a big update to the possibilities of our physics engine. First, we add all type of advanced joints to create complex simulation, which are really useful in sector using robotics, like automotive or aerospace. And we have improved the accuracy and performance compared with the previous versions. Following the feedback from our customer, we have included a new set of components to build vehicles physics simulations. Those components are properly documented to make it easy to simulate different types of industrial vehicle and physics environments. But the really cool thing is we were able to compile the physics engine to WebAssembly. So now all the features supported by physics on desktop are supported on web as well. And thanks to WebAssembly, the performance is the best possible on this platform compared with other options. Yeah, it is really cool, but let's continue. During the last year, we have been working in a new library called XRB. This is the result of the knowledge of several years developing virtual reality and mixed reality applications. With this new library, our customer will be able to reduce the time it takes to create new products for virtual reality and mixed reality devices. We have included a bunch of core services with common features required in all these types of applications and some built-in models for faster prototyping. And it is also easy to stand with custom models for every specific application. And thanks to the OpenXR standard, we continue updating the list of supported devices. We introduce in this release support for MetaQuest Pro and Pico 4 devices, which are the most recently added devices with the new interesting functionality like the pass-through, which allows you to run virtual reality and mixed reality application in the same device. And you can see in this video, the new possibilities are amazing. A part of this, we understand that tools have a big impact on the development process. So we have improved all of our tools in this new release. We have included filters in our Evergreen launcher to make it easy to find the best project templates by platform. And we have code the editor camera from scratch following the feedback we receive. The main target framework in Evergreen remains .NET which has long time support. But we have included new templates to start creating .NET 7 3D application using Evergreen today. It's time to talk about the new web-based possibilities in Evergreen. We already have a vanilla template for JavaScript, but most of our customers want to use React on top of this. So to help them, we have created a new template and a new NPM package for Evergreen. So now they can build a web application which rich 3D content using the ecosystem that they love. We put great focus to find a simple way to access the Evergreen Sense elements and properties from the web code. This is the default new basic project where you can try the communication in both directions. And now finally, let's talk about 
neural radiant fields, or NERF. This is a new way to capture and represent environments using artificial intelligence. We have become very popular in the last months. We are sure that this is going to change how we will capture and represent industrial environments. So we have working hard to implement different approaches of this new technology. One of the most popular approach was launched by NVIDIA and it is called Instant NGP. With this release, we are going to publish a new sample in our GitHub repository to start rendering real-time NERF using Evergreen and Instant NGP. Today is an important day for us in this journey, helping companies to find everything they need to build new 3D industrial products using Evergreen. This year, we are going to focus on new GPU renders that will allow the mix of point clouds, NERF, and beam models in real time. We would love to get your feedback so that we can continue to bring new innovations and capabilities into Evergreen. Thank you very much. Evergreen. Elevate your vision.